All right, Erica, temperatures dropping to 44 degrees right now. We did hit 61 today. We started at 35. Now, we're not going to get that cold tonight. Temperatures all across the area, generally in uh, the middle 40s here at home, and we're going to only drop a few more degrees into tomorrow morning. Uh, they've been bouncing around a little tonight. 43 in Mercer now, 48 at Guilford Lake, 48 at Beloit, and 46 right now in Minerva, 48 in Alliance. Now, temperatures tomorrow will get back to the 60s, although tomorrow's a different story than today with all the sunshine uh, because these clouds that we have in place now they're going to be around uh, through the day tomorrow and the showers that are still about 155 miles out to our west toward Lima, Finley and Bowling Green tonight. Uh, they will be marching in our direction into tomorrow morning. This storm system is going to chug on through here into the day tomorrow and right into tomorrow night. Eventually, this cold front uh, that's out in the Midwest tonight will sweep through here, uh, but not until later tomorrow night. So until that clears, uh, the risk of showers around and even a chance of a thunderstorm. Here's future tracker. Tomorrow morning, first thing in the morning, will start mainly dry. But as we go through the morning, temperatures will climb through the 50s. And we're going to see some of these isolated showers starting to pop up uh, through the morning as we go toward midday a little better better chance for some of these showers. Temperature up towards 60 degrees by noon. Uh, gusty wind out of the south up to 20 miles per hour uh, right into the afternoon and then the heavier rain tries to push on in into your Saturday afternoon. Yellow indicating a little bit of moderate rainfall out there and even the risk for thunder as we go into tomorrow evening and uh, tomorrow night. Temperatures will stay mild into the evening, but then that cold front pushes on through here. That'll end that threat for a thunderstorm. An isolated shower, a pocket of drizzle will stick in my forecast uh, through at least early Sunday morning. Uh, we start the day with a lot of clouds around, but by midday into the afternoon, we'll see the sunshine returning. So Saturday looking worse than Sunday, so not a complete washout for your weekend. Let's talk about the forecast as we go through tomorrow night. That rainfall will add up in spots. Uh, if you get stuck underneath one of those thunderstorms, could see close to three quarters of an inch of rainfall before this wraps up tomorrow night. So a decent dose of rain on our way this weekend. Fortunately, we dry out on Sunday. 43 tonight, mostly cloudy skies. Uh, tomorrow, clouds around 65, a gusty wind up to 20 miles per hour. Rain, chance of thunderstorms into the afternoon, uh, right into uh, tomorrow evening. Going to keep an eye on those as we go into our Saturday night. Seven day forecast gets better on Sunday. Again, that sunshine returns into the afternoon. 57, your high temperature. Uh, mostly sunny skies Monday. Again, back in the upper 50s. Close to 60 on Tuesday. A few more clouds around. And what is left of a, a partial tropical system, Patricia, which we're going to talk about. And also another storm system Wednesday. Could bring some heavy rain here. A Wednesday and then turning cooler after we get through the those storms Thursday and Friday highs only in the 40s. Looks like we're going to have to wear a few extra layers on Halloween, huh? Yeah, later <laughs> next week, even a few snowflakes trying to mix in. Oh, no. Yep. All right. Thanks, Paul.